Okay, what's my thing? Switch on to English or something. No, <laughs> you can do it now if you want to. Yeah. Mimic behavior, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this time. My god, the kush was a. Okay, now we. Hi, the Magpie! Uh, welcome to yet another bass video with my bass master Andrea. I haven't filmed preparing it because I was uh, in an argument on Discord voice chat while I was uh, doing what I did, but it went very fast. And it included a power saw tool thingy. It is a base, obviously, that's what we do when we hang out. We have nothing else in common. <laughs> <laughs> but I haven't told you, I haven't shown you, so we want to have that fun first reaction yeah, and see. Cool, cool. There's not, this is in the name of uh, fake science. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a regular base. Yeah, it's a regular base. And regular base strings. <laughs> it's the shortest scale bass <laughs> ever. If I my god, this is awesome. It's really cute. Yeah. Right. Why does it sound like shit? This is just a chopped off <laughs> neck. Yeah. You know? So they're so much wider than what the higher frets usually are. So you get a very strange scale. Yes, it's still compensating, so this is gonna be... It's like an octave here. Oh my, if you bend it a little bit. Okay, so there's some kind of science going on here. <laughs> <laughs> Leave your comments in the description to explain this phenomena. You can it. It's more. You can bend really far. You know. Okay. Or... Wow. So we're gonna hook up some pedals first. We just want to experiment here. We don't know where we're gonna end up or when we're gonna end up. Yeah. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> this was kind of. That was kind of cool. Oh. That.
So many cables! Kind of fun! Yeah, kind of fun. Very standard and uh, nothing crazy really, in my opinion. Yeah, except the tuning. I shouldn't hold it, I hold it very poorly. So yeah, this was most likely our most straightforward experiment so far, even though it looks kind of crazy. Yeah, and yeah, but... The only thing that's weird is, as you put it, the tuning. <laughs> yeah, it's really hard. But it's cool, because you can't come up with new ideas, like you wouldn't have otherwise. But you, yeah, you can, can could just detune your bass, but... But I mean, the scale, yeah, the like how you have to adapt Yeah, to, that's different, because yeah. like the... The steps are weird. Even the steps on the same string are weird, yeah, so that's... That's hard to emulate just on a regular bass, yeah. The only pedals that we actually played through was the bass went through the loaf at some point, and then the micro freak went through and... The, the red panda particle and then uh, the drum root was just going everything into a mixer uh, yeah. but it was funky for this to get yeah, some sense like and we also decided to record everything on multi-track because then we can put it into Cubase because we're going on a standard BPM so we're gonna bring it into Cubase and then yeah I bought uh, EP yeah should we awesome. make an EP based on all the different experiments that we do I feel like my posture is really weird to be <laughs> height with the camera. <laughs> we could make yeah, one with just one fret. The one fret base. <laughs> so we, we do it here. <laughs> it's just, <laughs> just that one. <laughs> Let us know if you want to see the one fret base <laughs> video. <laughs> And we will do that. And other than that, also let us know if you want to get an EP based on all of our experiments, but where we do some production as well. Because uh, we, we need to. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Other than that, have a jolly good golly golly dooly do. <laughs> Christmas. It's not. <laughs> our content is. Timeless. <laughs> People will watch this in the summer. <laughs> we can't say <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs>